I mean, we do kind of, you know, waste our time just a wee little bit, and then we get back and everything's dead. Well, it looks like we're going to have to find an, a way to get to the Enclave base out in the middle of the ocean. Now, how do we know that? Well, we figured that out by, uh, the Brotherhood, you know, when we talked to the Ace Machine in the Brotherhood place, and when we, um, were in Navarro, we kind of figured out where the base was, because the computers didn't really give a fuck. Now, I want to go see what's at Pariah's. Now, I'm not really sure how much time we have to go to get to the Enclave base, but... Uh, we ran into something. A group of spore plants and some silver geckos. No, thank you. And now there's probably two ways that we can get there. San Francisco, because it has the submarine. We, when we were talking to the computer emperor, I kind of did just a little bit of that off screen. Because he talked and talked and talked and talked. I know that they had like a little thing there. Go in there. Uh, you ain't uh, the fuck is pariahs? Or did I not actually go in there properly? I don't think I went in there properly. Hold on. Now, of course, at Navarro, we can go in it, but we probably will not be able to bring our companions. What the fuck is Pariahs? This is apparently what Pariahs is. What the fuck is this? It's that damn bad luck dog. Oh, well. Some bones. Now, our two options are to either go to Navarro and sneak in, but have none of our friends with us. Or we can probably go down to San Francisco and try to get a boat from there. And I'm kind of partial to the San Francisco option. So I'll see you guys in just a second. I'm going to travel down there. It's going to take quite a bit of time. So I'll see you guys in just a second. Well, on my way down, we run into us. King Arthur's Knights, apparently. Do you speak the king's tongue? Who the fuck are you guys? Hello, travelers. My name is Arthur, son of Uthor Pendragon from the Brotherhood of Steel. We are on a quest for the Holy Hand Grenade of Antioch. Hast thou seen it? Holy, what a hood, huh? The Holy Hand Grenade of Antioch. While well, it's only the greatest handheld anti personal weapon of its kind. Why do you search for such a terrible weapon? Uh, we of the Brotherhood of Steel seek to find the most devastating weapons of our ancestors and secure it from those who would abuse the power of the Holy Hand Grenade of Antioch. Why? Well, because the Brotherhood of Steel is dedicated to protecting the weak and defenseless, and this thing could really hurt someone. Why? Um, because it's really the only moral thing to do. Why? Well, uh, look now, we're really quite busy. Have you seen the Holy, uh, are you going to help us or not? Have you seen the Holy Hand Grenade of Antioch or not? Yes. Um, well, you didn't, why didn't you just say so? If you could just tell us where, we'll be off and you can get back to whatever it is you are doing. I just, it's over there. All right then, thank you for your help. Something for your trouble. Wait, I'm also on a quest. I seek the, no I don't. Can I barter with you? No, I cannot. Uh, Gek, you said, no, oh, yes, we have two of them. Don't need another one. The thanks all the same though. So you have two of them, maybe you could give me one. No, no, couldn't do that. Wouldn't be right to end your quest that easily. There's some more of them. That way, go get your own. He points in a direction about the same way you pointed when you told him where the holy hand grenade of Antioch was. Well, son of a bitch. Clip, club, clip, club. Holy hand grenade of Antioch and all that stupid bullshit. Anyway, moving on. I'll see you guys in just a second once more. We're on the roll. Okay, we're back in San Francisco now. I think the... Hmm, I don't know exactly where we're gonna need to go to to actually figure out where. Uh, hope you know where you're going. Yeah, I kinda have an idea. Honored visitor, you have done us a great service. Um, hmm. Death to the Hippologists. Now, I think... <gasps> now, I, I say this because it's pretty much the only place in the entire game that has, like, a dock or anything on the water. And because we have to go out to the, um... Uh, the, the unclaimed base is out to the water, and the, the computer thing said that to get there we had to, you know, go out on the water, and they said San Francisco possibly had a place that we could use. Now, how the fuck do I get over there? That's kind of, it's kind of what I'm thinking about where we need to, oh, there we go, never mind. Herp derp. Herp derp, herp derp. Alright, so maybe these guys, and uh, let's stay away from that. Radioactive goo. Do I want to talk to you? I always did like the waves. I think you liked something else, too. Hey, can we go in there? What's we got going on here? 
I don't know, but I'm gonna save anyway, because I haven't saved in a little bit. Alright, so what do we got going on here? A male tanker vagrant. I'm my own boss. I'll bet my boyfriend offered to share- oh. Oh my god, oh, oh. What's the matter with you? What's the matter with me? I'll tell you. It's that I got drunk last week, started gambling with Lao Chao and Law, so I was so blind drunk that I bet my spleen. Now he has it and I need it back. You sold your spleen. Yeah, I sold I was drunk. Plus, I think Lao Chao slipped some jet in my drink. I need my spleen back because I'm getting infections now. Um, hey, well, I'll take a look for it. They really appreciate this. Go talk to Lao Chao, the merchant, and tell him I need my spleen back. You, sir, are a very strange, strange individual. That's so cool. Is this Lao Chao? Sorry, but I'm closed. I open at 8. Please come back then. Well, let's wait till fucking morning. <laughs> Not that it was that far away. Howdy. Hello again, is there... Again? I don't think I've ever talked to you. Great, have a look. I've never talked to you. Oh my god, condoms. Who would buy such a debasing thing? I am offended. Offended! Great, oh great, have a, have a great day. Thank you. Goodbye. So, uh, I imagine somebody on this ship would be able to, uh, hey, that's guns. You know, I mean, this is a ship. I'll share my girlfriend if you share your... No, thank you. Want some information? Uh, I have no information to share. Sell. Uh, do you want to see my... Yeah, why not? I think you'll be pleased with my selection. No, probably not. You didn't think I would. Weapons my dick... Ooh, that's a mega power fist. Um, how much is a gek? Absolutely nothing. I don't feel like selling that. After the bomb, just add water. And yeah, then I bid you a pleasant day. A male punk. Doubt he has anything useful to say whatsoever. So assembly and borrow town their stills. Um, I'd flirt with you, but I'm not interested. Ugh. No, thank you. So, maybe this is not the place I need to go to get to the, uh, to get to the Enclave place. Maybe not. I'm unique, just like everyone else. Yes, yes you are. Alright, what else do we get here? So what about you? Uh, what do you want, Laowai? Um, what are you guarding? Everything, don't try anything funny. Can't you be any more specific? Um, alright, bye. Alright, so I'm not actually gonna go with the motorboat plan right yet. I really, really want to figure out a way to get me, Lenny, Marcus, all of those guys to get over our, um, to the Enclave base D to, as a group. I, I want to go as a group. I think that was that is pretty much the only way we're going to do it. I am not the highest level that I could be, so I'd like, the I'd like some help getting there. And since there really doesn't seem to be anything else over there, because we looked inside the little oil, the little, the big ass boat thing, we looked inside that. Um, I think the best next thing to do is go talk to the she, see if they've got anything. I know if we help the hobologist, I know they had that space shuttle. We could maybe have tried to use that, but that probably would have been a one-way ticket. And I don't think that would have been for the best. Okay, Nan, please move. Thank you. You are a good man. You are a good man. Let's go talk to scientist man over here real quick. What do you got to say? Um, who are you? More questions, please. What do you do here? Um, I'm in charge of the game. What are you planning? Oh, okay, thanks. Bye. Okay, nothing really can be solved there. Maybe we can go talk to this guy over here. The guy protecting the she emperor. What was his name? Kenley? Yeah, that's his name. Um, I have questions. Looking for some, uh... Nothing, thanks, bye. Okay, so that doesn't look like we're gonna get anything solved here, actually. We could go try to talk to the Emperor, but the Emperor's just a fucking computer, and I think we exhausted 90% of the conversation options there. So the only other option I think we have is Navarro. That or we can go search around that big ship some more and maybe see if we can get anything done there, but 
from the looks of what I mean, from what we had already seen in there, I don't think there's much that we can do. So we're gonna I'm gonna take one more pass through there, and if we can't find anything, we're gonna go ahead to Navarro. That seems to be the only really good course of action I think we can take. Now, mind you, chances are that we'll probably get in there and then have to kill everybody, but, <laughs> but that's a small price to pay, and it probably you know will warm us up for the fight ahead. Who the fuck are you? Female punk. Um, you got a special name? I don't know. Let's go ch to go check on this guy. He a punk wearing a half smile. Okay, well, apparently that bitch left out of there. Let's go talk to the punk wearing a half smile. He bodes his lovely. What do you want? <clears throat> hmm. Um, what can you tell me about this tanker? You have to talk to Mark or the captain about that. We're gonna find the captain. The captain's usually in the bridge. You just go up the stairs in the bar. I think that's all I... Easy enough. I assume this is the bar because I see food. Uh, I assume I will not be able to leave this room because my teammates are blocking me. Very good. Please move. Thank you, guys. You guys do good sometimes. And uh, that is a floor grating. The fuck are those stairs? He said take the stairs over here in the bar. Oh, wait, over there. Okay, that's the bar. Okay, good. Well, well, we'll just go talk to the captain. Maybe the captain has something to say. That urge is going to lead to another pointless side quest. To add to the other pointless side quest that we already have. Are you the captain? See, so someone wearing the captain's hat. What the hell do you want? I don't speak to anyone unless you're friends or good people. Do something for one of my buddies and then come talk to me. Okay. Look at these new punks posters. Oh, hipster punks in the post-apocalypse. What do you What do you know, right? Let's get down here. <sighs> okay, so the captain's not gonna do fucking jack all. So let's go talk to the half-smiling guy again. I wanna call him Dent, just because of, you know, it'd be funny, but I, I, I really don't know. The fuck is your name? Who are you? I'm Badger. I used to have a band. Called ourselves There We Smolder. Now I'm a resident computer tech in San Fran. Um, was the band any good? I'll say we kicked ass. Our singer was a, a bit of a ponce, and Aaron was always sweating, and everything else was Todd's fault, but we were good. Too bad you're not back together. I'd like to hurt you. Yeah, you would have anyway to get back to this. Wait, that's more questions. Um, can you tell me about the tanker? We're gonna find Mark. Down in the bar. More questions. Belch. Belch louder. He spits forth a horrific belch that defies the very heavens in its volume and depth. Applaud. Well, that's kind of fucking disgusting, but you know, whatever, right? Let's move on, move it on. Yes, let's go talk to Mark. You Mark. Friendly looking punk. Okay, I'm gonna assume that's Mark. Um, uh, what can I do for you, Mama Jama? Um, what is it? Who are you? I'm Mark. I'm the resident smart ash and know-it-all. He smiles. Okay, I have some other questions. Uh, what is this place? This is the Poseidon Marine Vessel Valdez. Also called the PMV Valdez. Valdez, Valdez, whatever. If you want more information about the Valdez, the best person to talk to is the captain. Who's that? The captain is a tough old, a, a tough-ass old military guy. He sits upstairs there and checks the place out. He's got some thorough knowledge of the ship. Um, Captain... Okay. Son of a bitch, there's not really much I can get done here with these guys, is there? What about you? You bet you don't have time to sit and relax. I'd fill it with you, but uh, I'm not interested. Well, I'm not really interested either, you punk ass bitch. Okay, who are you? See, a male tank. Oh, you know, that's a, just a vagrant. Okay, so obviously there's somebody in here that we can do shit for. But, I don't know who, and on that same token, see nothing out of the ordinary, female punk, I'm open minded, huh, ugh, no thank you, I, I, uh, I am quite happy with my current status of not being in a relationship with a woman with a green mohawk, thank you, goodbye. So, the fuck do we gotta do? 
I don't really, don't really, nor rightly know. I, I, I don't know. Maybe, 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 maybe we missed something. Maybe we did. Let's go talk to Badger again. I don't think we actually exhausted all the options with him. A punk wearing a half smile. Um, what do you do here? What sort of computer stuff do you do? Let's just say, what does that mean? Means I can find. I see. Cool. I have more questions. Uh, what can you tell me about the tanker? Oh, son of a bitch. More questions. Who are you? I bet your band sucked. Will ya? Fuck you. Hey. Uh. Uh. Gross. Fuck. I don't think we have much we can do here. Do can't do we? Uh. 